princess Well, I see no trace of her So you're going to attack me? Conversation is over Victory is mine, I am finally rid of the hassle But I just found out that our princess is in another castle So it is you, who's in charge of this tribe The pain I will bring you, will be so hard to describe
you care And I'll put an end to your reign of fear Now tell me where the fair princess is And I might not throw you in a bed <laughs>
all of the true villain's designs were undone as if nothing had ever happened. Only our hero remembers the facts. The hero falls from a great height in a last act of defiance against the laws of physics. He is unconscious. And so we come to the end of this song, a melody given rhyme and reason by the sound of the hero's voice. But was he the author of this piece? Or was this song written by God Air Forces hard at work? As the sun rises, the final chord displayed, the hero of this song side by side with his princess begins to forge a new path. They are not headed right nor left. They are moving forward.
It was just like that, if I recall, that a song was heard by y'all. The hero was recognized by people that finally realized that he was the one who heard the call. The song spoke of a villain who once cursed reality and a hero who fought to the end, defeating evil and returning our land to normality. Oh, praise the hero, they shouted with their true voices that had one faded away. I was just a child, yet my memories of those peaceful times were never lost, not even for a day. Many bards heard the hero's deed, and they too began to sing. Then, after some years, through many joys and cheers, the people made him king. And now, both king and queen in an immense castle dwell. A sorcerer used to live there, but no one seems to know or care if he's still alive and well. Now I belong to the king's court. I know you think a kid, but I can prove to you. Ask the hero no further ado, and he will say my name. Sit. Just a bear. 
Fire my team.